Joining us this morning is News 13's own Kim Baez. I call her the queen of coupons. <laughs> now she's married, she has two small lady. kids and a full-time job. And just like any of us, you really want to save on time, but you're trying to look for ways to economize. And she's going to share with us something that she does on her family grocery bill. Okay. It is. Uh, somebody here actually at work told me about it. It is this thing. It's a paid service, but it's crazy how much it saves you. It's called the grocery game. Basically, you pay $10 for the first store you sign up for, five for each additional. So I sign up for Albertsons and Smith's, and I spend $15 every eight weeks to be a member. But basically what it does is it tells you when an item is going to be the absolute cheapest rock bottom price within a 12-week period, and you have a coupon for it, so it makes it that much cheaper. So it pretty much tells you what to buy and when to buy it, because what I've learned through this is even though it's on sale, it doesn't mean it's going to be the cheapest. You can get stuff for free. It's gotten to where I spend for a family of four, and we eat a lot. We spend, I spend about $60 a week on groceries. It includes toiletries. It includes shampoos. It includes personal items. It includes a lot. Besides my trip to Walmart every so often to get little things or my trip to Costco, that's everything that I need for my family. Sometimes diapers, too, for my kids. Okay, so how does it work? Basically, you sign up online, and I'm sure we'll put a link on our website um, about how to do it. But you go in on Sundays. That's the key. You need to have time on Sunday, Monday, or Tuesday to go shopping. Because what this lady does, I don't know how she does it, but she has access to not just the advertised specials. I mean, I have all of my circulars that I go through, and I still write them down every week in case the the list misses it. But they have unadvertised specials. You go in there and there's something on sale that's not advertised. And so it basically tells you there's a list and you go online and things are coded in different colors. If it's green, it's free. If it's blue, it's the, the cheapest it's going to be. You should buy it now. If it's black, it's it's at a reasonable price, but don't get it unless you really, really need it. And basically, this is the list. You go through and you click off what you need and then you go shopping for that Sunday through Tuesday and it saves you a ton of money. And the thing is though, that's the key. You're, you're clipping coupons every week. So in your Sunday paper, everybody laughs at me because this <laughs> is my coupon holder. Most people are like this big, no, this is mine. And you clip every single coupon that comes, even if it's stuff you think you may not use. When it comes up on the list and it's 25 cents, you're gonna buy it and you'll try new things. That's a good thing. It gets you to try new things that you wouldn't try before. So it's pairing coupons with sale prices and it tells you when to do it so it's not as much work for you to do basically. All right. Well, very good. We're going to go ahead. There it is. The grocery game and you should use your email because you get credit. Yeah, that's every time you sign somebody else up, every three people that sign up, then you get your membership for free. So, and it's kind of complicated and it seems very, it takes a lot of time off the top because you're really getting used to it. And it's about stockpiling. Like, um, so shampoo was on sale this week, herbal essences. I got it for a dollar a bottle. It's usually like, like four. Um, I bought six of them. So you have to have room to stockpile. I have like 12 boxes of cereal in my pantry. I freeze milk. I freeze butter. I have a huge upright freezer. So you have to stockpile. But So it's kind of complicated, but feel free to email me at my website if you have any questions or something at my email here at work. And very quickly, what did you uh, save this week? Oh, this week I spent, let me see, I spent 37 and I saved 53. So basically I would have spent $90 on what I bought, but I spent 37 Great. Thanks a lot, Kim. She's the queen of coupons.